We should get something decent out of here, man. This is in the wasteland. We have maxed out Lucky Looter. Ho, ho, ho. Look at that. Damn. Welcome back, everybody, to 7 Days to Die. I'm the Bearded OG, and this is the Insane Nightmare Series. And in this episode, we're going to go out and do a job. Uh, because I have been working my tail off to get that new horde base ready, and it's pretty much ready to go. I still need to, to do that second um, layer down at the bottom. But uh, I'm waiting for steel uh, to cook up. I went out and mined a whole mess of iron the night before. And over there in our um, underground bunker, we have some steel cooking up. Um, so I'm going to, you know, f take care of that later. So we got a few things in here to sell, and I also have a magazine to read. Let's grab that stuff, and uh, let's go see Trader Bob. And we also have a treasure that's quite a ways out. So I think what we'll do uh, for that is we'll take our... Uh, we'll take the motorcycle and leave the four by here because it's, uh, you know, just uses a lot, a lot more gas and isn't quite as fast. Uh, but if we're going to do that, we should probably take, really? All right. God damn it. Off with your fucking head, bitch. All right. Here they come. Come join the party. They like this door here. Usually. Where are you? Is that everybody? No, I hear. I still hear Zeke's. Get away from my truck. We gotta get this. <laughs> what the hell? Are you dead? The truck killed her. <laughs> Thanks, truck. <coughs> I gotta figure out a way to get this truck inside. Uh, but I don't want to mess with that right now. Okay, so anyway. As I was about to say, we should probably bring some meds with us. So let's pull some of that out of here. Um, let's wear... Uh, actually, let's bring that with us. And there's a, a Zeke over there. And we'll read this. Are you out yet? Yeah, now you are. You're a feral motherfucker. And hit way harder than you can, bub. Okay, uh, let's see. We'll bring... We'll bring awesome sauce and sugar butts and all that shit just in case we come across the gyrocopter... Uh, chassis. I got the... I got the... Accessories in a drop, but I didn't get the... God, I can't think tonight. <laughs> uh, I got the accessories, but we still need the chassis. So if we happen to run across that with one of the traders, then we'll have it with us, right? And we'll take a honey too. Uh, I guess we need those in case we get a laceration. Do we? You, can you still get lacerations in this game? I don't think I've gotten a single one uh, since I started this playthrough. That doesn't mean you can't. I'm just saying I haven't gotten one. I would think you probably can. Oh yeah, suture laceration. So it still, it still seems to indicate that you can. So let's put all these meds in here, and um, we'll put the awesome sauce in there and the pumpkin cheesecake. Okay, and then for the for the meat. And the bone and stuff. I'm just going to put that in the drop chest for now. 
It is getting late. I mean, I don't care if we're out after dark for, like, questing. As long as it's not in the wasteland. But, uh, if we're going to go to the trader, we need to get over there quick. Pretty quick. Fairly quick. <laughs> I think that treasure that we have is in the desert, so... Uh, you know, being in the desert not a, at night time is not a big deal. So let's go see what Bob has. Uh, I did visit him, I think, maybe a couple of in-game days, uh, in -game days ago, but I don't remember when it said he was going to reset. So we'll go see what he has. Is this car repopped at all? It hasn't. Okay. Oh, yeah, I guess we're a little hurt. I tracked the buzzards. Let's just go this way. You know what? I actually want their giblets because we're still making farm plots. Okay, um, you got three. Oh shit! Nice. I already have like three or four of those already, though. Um, let's buy the, another sugar butts. And that's yeah. Okay. We buy and sell vehicles, mechanical parts, and electric. Well, I'll be dipped. That's the 4x4. Four four. Oh, next you don't, I... Oh, shit. I left my glasses. Uh, I left my glasses back in the truck. Too many things distracted me. Okay, well, let's just see what he has. This None of this is big ticket stuff, so I'm just going to sell it. Oh, he doesn't even want those. I think... I don't think he's, he's um, updated since I was here last. Yeah, he updates tomorrow, so... He's not going to have anything really we want. I mean, I could buy a vehicle magazine, I suppose, but... There, there's a higher probability that we're going to be able to buy the gyrocopter chassis before we'll level up high enough to make it ourselves. Yeah. Okay. You can't beat that with a stick. Oh, job. Right. That's actually the main reason I came here. Okay, so we got a tier four in infested. We got two infesteds. Um, what's Ain't this? Do, huh? I reckon I could find you something. You know the, uh, okay. I haven't been in this, in this PO in a long just time. Let's just take that one. get fat and hogs get slaughtered. And you'll be fine. Not really in the mood to do a, an infested right now. <laughs> that last one we did, which was only a tier three, was like, oh my god, I couldn't believe how intense that was. Um, okay, so, tell you what though, before we do his job, let's go... Let's go hit this treasure. So it is, uh, let's see, where's that? Oh, wow, wow, that is way the hell up there. We could, um, we could actually get there though through my other little shortcut that I made. So it won't be quite as far as it would be if we went, you know, uh, stick stayed on the highways. So let's go do that and then we'll come back and we'll do that Favales, or however you pronounce that, Academy. While we're out here, we'll check the other Trader Bob, too. But, yeah, see, they reset tomorrow, though. Shit, I wish I would have brought those glasses with me. Uh, I'll tell you what, if he does have the gyrocopter or something else that we really want, I'm, I'm going to go back and get my glasses. I think we can do it. Um, you know, on the motorcycle because we can go so fast here. But his shop is actually way over here. Yeah, it's right here, actually. Not far at all. Maybe he'll buy these batteries from us, too. Well, looky here. I got vehicles so slick. Four by make four. Make a roadrunner jealous. Make a roadrunner jealous, huh? Hmm. I wouldn't mind getting another silencer. Um, I have one too that I was gonna put on the sniper rifle, and I forgot to do that. Yeah, let's uh, let's buy that silencer. Well, hold on, let's not do it quite yet. Let's see what else he has. 
He's got some enforcer sunglasses, but I'm not buying those because we already own some. Okay, let's sell him that in... Why do I have two engines in my inventory? I don't know. We'll sell those too. Hey, you want some feathers, dude? You want some bones? I ain't interested in any more of that. <laughs> He's not interested in the bones. Okay. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and buy that other silencer. Don't forget repair kits. All right. You don't want to end up stranded or have your gun jam on you. I think. Boy. Increases damage, range, and aimed accuracy. I don't know if I want to give any of these up, because how many times am I shooting at bears with these, right? Ah, shit. Okay, well. Oh, I, I can only... Okay. Yeah, I don't know if I... I don't think I want to give up damage for this. Rats. I shouldn't have bought it, but... Oh, well. Now we have two. <laughs> Now we have to. Not a big deal. Maybe we'll get something, you know, that will uh, you know, have two weapons that maybe we'll want to put it on. We'll see. Okay, so I'm trying to remember where my little tunnel through the mountain was. I haven't been over here in a long time. Let me look at this. Gonna be right around there. It'd be difficult to spot though. Is that it? Yeah, I think that's it right there. Yep, this is it. Oh my god, this is gonna be tight. <laughs> I was on the mini bike the last time. Okay, no, we're good. We're good. So we come down through here and then follow this road, and then we'll have another smaller tunnel that we need to go through. But this is this is the way across the mountains that I found anyway. Obviously, we wouldn't be able to take the four by this way, but the motorcycle we can. And then we actually bail off this way. Woohoo! <laughs> and then we come over around through here. And our other tunnel is right here. There we go. Nice. Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah. See? How about that, huh? Oh, this is, there's an old west town here, too. I, I haven't done, done anything with it. I just, you know, saw it when I came over here, but I haven't looted it or anything. Those are kind of fun to do. Ooh. Maybe this is still in the wasteland. That's actually a good as long as we can get it before nightfall. Yeah, it is. Higher chance for better loot. Oh, nice. Okay. But yeah, we got to do this quick. We have like one in-game hour. I don't want to go loud if I don't have to. Okay, let's go. There we go. We should get something decent out of here, man. This is in the wasteland. We have maxed out Lucky Looter. Ho, ho, ho. Look at that. Damn. Nice. A level five auto shotgun. That was worth the price of admission. Okay. Get out of the wasteland. Look at that, you guys. Amazing. All right, let's repair it. And then what we're going to do is take that stuff off. K. 
can... Okay, yeah, I can put that on. Oh, I can put a silencer on this. Uh... I don't know why... I, uh, I don't know why I would do that, though. Uh, I, we need to save this slot for... Um, I mean, I, I don't know how much it's, it's going to actually make it more silent. Plus, I don't want to give up, you know, this is a, da a pure damage mod. Uh, but what we do want to put on there, of course, is a drum magazine, which I can make. Um, we learned that, like, really early on. Right. Okay, cool. Well, look at that. That was, that was awesome. Uh, let's take our orange paint off and put it on here, because that's how we do. Don't ask me why. I can't explain it. It's just the way it is. Look at this. Awesome. Okay. Oh, actually, you know, the other thing I want to actually put on there, though, is a um, an automatic trigger, too. So, yeah, we'll have to do that as well. I might have one of those back at the base. If I don't, I'm not sure if I can make one, but we'll see. Tell you what, let's go home first and get this thing fixed up, and then we'll go out and do that quest at nighttime. So I'll just meet you guys back at the house. All right, guys, um, let's go ahead and get a drum magazine going here. Ah, uh, shit, you know what? I don't think I have any steel here. I've got a bunch of steel out at the cave. Cook it up. Do I have any in the truck? Fuck off, Ronald McDonald. I don't shit. Um, okay, do I have enough iron uh, in the forge to make, tw uh, what is it, 20 steel? Uh, nope. Nothing's ever easy. Okay, well, then uh, we're going to have to run out there and grab some steel. I mean, we need to do it anyway. It's just that I didn't want to do it right now. The other thing was the trigger mod. That if I have it's going to be in the gun safe we do not shit okay can I make the trigger mod I can't <laughs> shit alright next question does any of my uh, where am I at does any of these weapons have it? Oh, look at that. Okay, good. So we we have it on the assault rifle. Good deal. Okay, so we'll take that off of there. Um, I think we can actually put a retracting on here too. So, um, yeah, there's that other silencer. Okay, so let's go here, modify. Uh, we definitely want the auto trigger mod. And then we would definitely want the rad remover. So I think once we get the drum, it's just going to have to take the place of the foregrip. Uh, what? Okay, so this is... That's a firing from the hip. Okay, so that's an accuracy thing, but, you know, this is a shotgun. <laughs> We don't need to be that accurate with it. Okay. So, yeah, that was fortuitous that we had the um, that aut automatic trigger mod. Because otherwise, this is a semi-automatic weapon. So now I can just pretty much spray and pray. But what we got to do, of course, is we've got to get um, the drum mod. Yeah, let's put this in there. I think... Now that I have this, I'm going to start carrying two stacks of shoddy shells with me. Uh, those actually can go back in there. Okay, so let's see. We've got... I don't know how, I don't know how long it takes to make this. But we do have work a workbench at the cave, so let's grab... Uh, ten of these. Well, you know what? It doesn't matter. We got to come back this way, anyways. 
All right, well, I'm going to cut the camera here then, guys. I'm going to run out and grab the steel, come back here, get this drum magazine mod made, and then once once it's made, uh, then we'll go do that job. All right, guys, um, I got this cooking up. It's going to take about five minutes. And I got to thinking the uh, all mods that you put on these weapons have the same amount of damage. So I, I was saying earlier this is a damage mod, but it's not. It just gives you a wider spread which is not always desirable so let's let's give the duck bill a try um i i kind of like it but uh i haven't used it in a while so we'll try that and see see how we do with it and then um and then we'll put the um whatchamacallit the the drum magazine uh in that other slot okay so, yeah, I guess we'll just wait for that to finish, and then um, our job, let's go ahead and activate it, uh, is going to be right over there. So I'll just meet you guys over there here in just a little bit. All right, guys, uh, I am on my way to our destination, and we, this cop car has reset, and we also have a wolf over here. All right, let's see what's inside of here. All right. That's decent stuff. That's reset also. I say, where'd he go? Saw another Zeke down the road a little ways, but... There you are. Off with your head. Take that stuff. Uh, I should come back here and harvest the, all those body bags, but I don't want to do that right now. Okay, let's go. I don't know if they've changed this. Um, yeah, that's been open. I don't know if they've changed this PO. I haven't done it in a long time. So it could be new, or it could be the same as it's always been, but I guess we'll find out here soon enough, won't we? Looking forward to looting this town and doing all the POIs. I mean, I've pretty much done nothing but work, you know, since we've gotten here. I've enjoyed every minute of it, of course, but it's time to go do some looting. Some rootin' tootin' looting. Are you dead? You are now. Fuck off. Gotta love that feral sense, man. Yeah, there's another explosives. Um, I can make the level one rocket launcher now, but level one, more than likely, will probably buy one off the trader before we get high enough to, to actually make it, but we'll see. Um, you know what? Fuck it. I'll just read that. Not that I really give a shit about that. Though I have heard that um, uh, Knuckles are not bad uh, in the game now. I don't know. I haven't tried fisticuffs in a long time in this game. That's all stuff that we'll just sell at the trader. I'm going to... Well, let's keep them for now. Uh-oh. No fair. You can't attack me when I'm having a null reference error. That's not fair. Oh, yeah, we'll have to go do that seven days sweets. Uh, in fact, is that a tier four or a tier five? I don't know. Oh, it's a tier five. Okay. There's another wolf. Rifle magazine.
Well, it looks the same on the outside. Vehicle magazine. Um, none of these vehicles are lootable. I didn't bring my um, impact driver with me. Otherwise, I'd take that bus apart. Is this lootable? Oh, that's a that's an upgrade because we have a yellow mining hat. Get out of here, Edgar. You too, Ronald. Okay, let's quit fucking around and get this thing going. I hear a cre creepy crawly. Yeah, that's an upgrade because uh, our current mining, mining, well, all of my mining pieces are green. So let's get rid of that. Oh, there you are. Actually, let's do this. We'll scrap this. Um. <clears throat> oh, right. We got the rifle book. Let's read that real quick. No, I want to wear you, not throw you on the ground. Don't need the cornmeal. Oh, shit, what am I doing? We have another one to read. I'm paying attention, that's what I'm doing. Okay, where? There. Okay, I think we're ready to do this. He says as he continues realizing he's not ready to do this. Now we're ready to do this. That's all the stuff we want to take with us. All right, what is this? This is a clear. Search the bus again. Oh, look at that. Nice, nice, nice. Search the car again. Let's go around back and get... Oh. These reset too. Nice. I don't think either one of those were lootable. The first time. Oh, shit, there's a mountain line right there. One of these days I'll actually get started on this quest. It'll happen. Okay, we're going to go around back and see if that army truck is once again lootable, and then we're going in. Can't believe it's morning already, and it's day 70. Nope, it's not lootable this time. Should have checked this. So we'll do this quest. We'll go do the turn-in, and, and also um, Bob will be have a new inventory. And then I'll probably... Uh, I need to go get the rest of the horde base ready for tonight. Okay, let's do this. Man, look at all the red dots we already have. Oh shit. This is not an infested quest. Tough sons of bitches. Damn. Oh shit. It scared me. Big mama, where are you? Oh. 
She dropped a bag. Nice. I hear more footsteps. We got somebody around over that way. In here? Oh yeah, look at you stuck, Bo. Not anymore. Okay. Didn't there used to be uh, lockers right there? There, I think there did used to be. Doesn't work. Okay, so we checked that room. Nothing else in here that I can tell. Guess we'll take that. Another irradiated cop. Another vehicle magazine. Okay, let's see if we're in here. This, uh, this is different, isn't it? I don't remember part of this school being under construction. Must have stepped on one of those thingies on the floor. Are there wall safes in schools? <laughs> oh shit! Getting that double penetration, baby. Oh shit! Still have one more dude somewhere in here. Come on, god damn it. Give me your head. Okay. Yeah, this is a little bit different than it used to be. I think. What's, uh, oh. Nice. In fact, we could probably stand to eat one of those. I already had one in my inventory that I made earlier. That's cornmeal. Alright, let's just leave that there. I've got a pile of cornmeal already, so we don't need to take up an inventory slot with that right now. Uh, let's go grab a honey and drop off whatever we can here. Don't want that. Grab that. Don't want this. Don't want this. Um, let's scrap those. And uh, let's read these. Rocket launcher quality one. Oh, maybe I, w I guess I didn't know the rocket launcher yet. Now I do. <laughs> I thought I had, but I was obviously mistaken. Sniper rifle quality one. Okay, cool. All right, let's put this back on. Uh, we don't need that. Yeah, I, I'm not going to hang on to two of those. Okay, good enough. Let's go. I'm in a little bit of a hurry just because um, I, I've, I've still got a couple more things that I want to get done on the horde base, so... Come to the door. Oh, shit. Well, that's one way to come to the door. Eat some duck bill, buddy. All right, that's it for in here. Is 
Sledgehammer magazine. Quickly check all of these. I've come to the conclusion, by the way. Oh, there's a bowl. I think that's like the first bowl we found, isn't it? That the um, the empty jars that the mod that we are using provides are not really all that useful. Because A, I can't make them. I can only find them in loot. And B, they're not... Um, uh, they're consumed. So they're just not really that useful. What... Right. Okay, I think that's it for down here. Scrap that. Scrap those. Those. That. Um, I'm really low on cloth, so I'm going to keep that cloth. Don't need yucca. Okay, let's go. Uh, up the stairs. Red dots in here. Arrow archery book. Nope, let's leave that alone. dead I think so okay uh, let's stay over on this side so yeah this place is uh, it's familiar but it's it is changed a little bit but not drastically What the hell? <laughs> Was that in here before? I don't remember that. It's kind of morbid. Alright, let's go in here. That leads us up into an attic. I think... Um... I think we have to go up in the attic to get down into the other rooms. Uh, this room in here, unless I want to break all those spikes, which I don't particularly want to do. Alright. So, let's do that. See, I don't remember this. I think all of this is new. Oh my god, look at all the red dots. Ooh. Oh no! Alright. It is no no. Oh shit. Nope, no spinning. No no. Alright, fuck you and your no no. <laughs> that sounds weird. We're not done yet. There's three more, plus you. There's two more. One more. Uh, and we've got a got a sprained leg. I don't have time for that. Never do. Um, you know what? Let's actually quickly. Might 
might behoove me just to carry that that armor with me. It's just that it takes up another slot, though. You know, it's a thing. Okay. We only have one more Zeke to kill. You're just an outside, right? Oh. Um, okay, let's go back up this way. Where are you? Oh, he just died. <laughs> what the hell? Something killed him. Okay. What's in this tent? Not really anything. That sucks. Well, there's the loot. <coughs> okay. Big ass ammo pile. Should have enough room for whatever's in here. Yeah, that was uh that was pretty nasty for just a normal tier four. Can you imagine if we would have done a a uh nomad boots run speed? We would have done this as an infested? I mean we could have done it, but uh, I couldn't have rushed through it like I did here. Uh no, let's not take that. How much is that worth? Nope, not even worth picking up to sell. Ooh, wow, look at that. I mean, I've, I've got better, but that's still a really nice find. We'll take that and... Uh, t -t 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 uh, we don't need the hop seed. Take the brass instead. Okay, so if the loot's up there, why would we come down here? For what purpose? Oh, for that purpose, I guess. Uh, yeah, all right. I guess that's it. Oh, I left the, I left the nerd armor on. That's okay. It's heavy armor, too. Uh, okay, so let's read these. Very good. And now we will grab all of the other books. Howdy. You're just in time to check out our specials. All right. Well, now you can strut sitting down. Good job. Um. Let's do... Problem with these, if I take them, is then it's going to take up another inventory slot, and our crossbow is not really our main weapon. I already have impact bracers. I don't need cement. I know this, so I guess we'll take the forged steel, because we do we do need it. Step right up and see what tickles your pistons. <laughs> tickles your pistons. That's the first time I've heard him say that. Oh my god, that's funny. All right, sell him all of that stuff. And I think that's all we're going to sell them. Now, let's... T oh, uh, no, wait. We're, we're looking for the gyro chassis, not the 4x4. We got that. Let's take a quick look at his inventory. Okay, look at this. We should buy that. I'm not going to be able to use it tonight because I got to make the rockets for it. But it's going to be a long, long time, guys, for we're going to be able to make an epic rocket launcher. So what I'm going to do is we're going to go back to the base and get all of our stuff out Andy. of... Um, let's buy those. I already have some, but... 
We're gonna get our oh shit, our, our cheesecake. Is that a horde or just two zombs? It's just two zombs standing out here. We'll get our cheesecake, our awesome sauce, our sugar butts, and our enforcer glasses. And we'll come back and buy that. We'll get one hell of a discount on it. So rockets are really pretty damned expensive to make. So I don't know that I'm always going to have a big supply of rockets for every Horde Knight moving forward. What it might end up having to be is we accumulate them and then we use them and then, you know, uh, one or two Horde Knights goes by before we use it again. Or we use it every Horde Knight, but obviously we are not going to, I don't think we'll have enough ammunition for it to last the entire night. And then we'll just use grenades when it runs out. I don't know. We'll figure that out. We will figure that out. Okay. Well, looky here. Looky here. I called myself a customer. What can I get you? You can get me a rocket launcher. Or a huge discount. Okay, and we got the enforcer glasses that give us another 10% barter. So aside from putting Why don't you take a, a look few more points yourself? into better barter, we can't this is the best deal we can get. Alright, where did that thing go? There it is. Yeah, see, now it's 5,400. Wasn't it like over 9,000, I think? So, one hell of a deal. Why well, we got all these buffs going, um... I mean, I could buy... How much would that cost me? Eh, nah. I can make steel. I don't want to spend that much money on steel. Is there anything else? These things are just atrociously expensive. Let's buy all... Well, not all, but magazines that we're still interested in reading. Uh, let's let's buy. Th oh, you can only buy one of those. Okay, because these are damned expensive too. Normally, so now's the time to get them, right? Okay, we can buy. Yeah, let's buy these, because it's the frag ones that we want. We don't want the other ones, because the other ones will destroy our, our base. Um, I'll buy the sewing kits. Getting kind of low on those. How much would it cost for this AP? Nah, I can make that. I, I just don't like to buy stuff that I can, you know, pretty easily make. Just because we have a discount doesn't mean we should buy stuff that we don't really need to buy, you know? So... Yeah, I think, uh, I think that's it. Tell your friends about me. Uh, Trainer Bob. Okay. Trainer Bob. <laughs> Where are you? Um... Okay, so we have four minutes on sugar butts and three minutes on pumpkin cheesecake. Might behoove us to run over to Jen really quick and just see what she has. Um, and I can also stop uh, along the way back. I can stop and get the rest of my steel. So let's do that. Or maybe instead we go to the other Trader Bob up north because he'll have a, I think he'll have a better chance of possibly having a, gyrocopter chassis. Yeah, let's do that instead. Okay, let's see what this guy has. If you got the dukes, well, I'll be a monkey's wrench. Buy the water filter. Frag ammo. He's got a full 4x4 truck. <laughs> that's 54,000, and that's with our discount. That's crazy. Okay. You can't beat that with a stick. Well, I, I think we still got the nerdy on. Okay, let's read these. I think we got pretty good deals overall. We got two filters at a big discount. 
Okay, so um, I'm gonna go get all the shit together that I need and head over to the horde base and um, show you uh, what I have finished and what I have left to do. All right, guys, we are at the horde base and I'm gonna actually stick all of this stuff up in here for the moment. Uh, let's let's keep let's keep a hundred and uh, yeah, let's keep like a hundred and fifty steel in here so we have it for repairs afterwards. Hopefully that will be enough. Um, and I may n I may not use all of this, but I probably will for what we're gonna do. And then I'm gonna put these in my inventory now, just so I have them. I'm gonna want some oh shits. And do I have all the other meds in in here? No, I don't have any meds in there. Shit. Okay. So let's make sure we have. Oh, we, oh, we already have pills. Okay, so got five big kits, five small ones, broken legs, steroids, fatigue, concussion, infection. Uh, we don't need fort bites for this. Right. Okay. All right. So let's head on down. And I decided, you know, after all that messing around, not to use the relays. Um, and the reason being is because having a direct connection from the generator to each fence is, you know, builds in more redundancy to the system. Uh, whereas if I have the relay up here and that relay takes damage for some reason, not that it probably ever would but if it did then all of the fence posts are out uh, the other thing that i did was i put in these scaffolding bars here so that if you know if they do get broken i can reconnect them from here and i did confirm that i can still reach all the way over there and, and reconnect it which i can i just i didn't bring the wiring tool down here with me to show you that but um and then i, I decided to go ahead and add more stone in here too so we just have a flat platform all the way around. I did that more, more for aesthetics, but it'll make it easier for us to get to stuff too. Okay, so you should be fully fueled. And I'm going to go ahead and turn this on now just so I don't forget. All right, so basically uh, down here, uh, I got two vault doors in and everything all the way six blocks up is, is steel. Um, and then there's our little electric fence grid up there but what I want to do is I want to starting in this corner I want to double line this um so I think I'll only go up five though for the double alignment because that's the radius of a demolisher and then so the plan is to do this all the way around and hopefully, I have enough material to that. We might be a little shy on the cobblestone, but we'll see how it goes. And let's also get the that upgraded to steel, too. Okay. So, yeah, I'm just going to work my way around. Uh, one, two, three, four. Yeah, one more on both sides and double align this and then this base should be ready to go so guys that's going to be it for this episode when we start the next episode it will be the start of horde night 70 uh we have we have one point we uh, i may get this other point by doing all this upgrading but we need a total of three points to get astute awareness and then i i have an effective i'll have an effective 10 because i've got the perception mod in there and then as soon as we get that taken care of then our next point we'll put into maxed out explosives and uh, yeah so that's the plan 
All right, everybody. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment, share the video. And we'll catch you all in the next episode for Horde Night 70. See ya.